<clears throat> Hi guys, Sarah here from Crochet Lefty and today we are going to learn the Broadway stitch. I don't know if you guys can see this. On one side of this swatch you're going to have these diagonal uh, triple crochet across and on the back side it's going to be all um, even stitching. There's no there's no cabling across the back. So this stitch is done using the double crochet, single crochet, and the triple crochet. If you need any help with those stitches, um, you can find those additional videos in uh, on my crochet channel. Okay. So today we're going to be using the Red Heart Soft, and that is an off-white. And we're going to use this yarn's preferred hook, and that is the 55 millimeter eye hook. So I have my little eye hook here. You will also need a pair of scissors and a yarn needle to weave in your ends. Okay, so this stitch is done in multiples of 8 plus two. Okay, so I will be doing 16 and then adding the additional two to my foundation chain. Okay, so start with your slip knot. So here's my 16 and plus 2. Okay, so the first row is worked all in single crochet. So it's just your normal skip one, and in the second chain from the hook, you're going to do your single crochets. So you're going to insert your hook, yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, and you will do the single crochet across the chain. Now that you've completed all the single crochets across your chain, get out some more yarn here. You're going to chain three. So one, two, and three. Now this first chain is going to count as your first double crochet. Okay? Now for this stitch, since this is counting as your first double crochet, we're going to skip this first chain or this first stitch right here and we will be working into these three stitches right here one two and three now we're going to skip these two chains or these two stitches right here and we're going to do a, a triple double crochet so we're going to yarn over twice and we're going to insert our hook into that third chain start that over so on that third chain, yarn over twice, insert your hook, yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through the last two. So you're going to have this, this triangle type shape here. Now what we're going to do is we're going to yarn over and we're going to put one double crochet into each of these chains here. Okay? Now this can be a little difficult for a left-hander, so this 
stitch is going to be on the front of your work. So if you're so you're going to want to twist your work so that you can get into those these two chains right here. Yarn over. And you're going to start with the one furthest away. Don't forget. You got to skip skipping this chain here and we're going to work into this chain. So we're going to insert our hook. Okay, we're going to yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, and yarn over, pull through two. Okay? Yarn over and we're going to work into this next stitch. Insert your hook, yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. And so this is how your work will look. You're going to have the treble crochet across the two double crochets. So this is the back of your work and this is the front of your work. Okay. So now into this stitch here we're going to do one double crochet. Okay. Now in these three stitches here is where we're going to do our next Broadway stitch. So we're going to yarn over twice for our treble and we're going to go into the third chain here. Third stitch, I mean. We're going to insert a hook, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, and pull through two. Okay, again we have that triangle type stitch. Now, turning our work slightly so that we can get to these two stitches back here. Insert our hook, one double crochet, insert our hook, yarn over, yarn over, yarn over. Okay, and again into that chain here, that stitch there, we're going to do one double crochet. So insert your hook, okay, we've completed that. Now into the next stitch here, one double crochet. Now in the next three stitches, we're going to do one triple crochet into that third stitch. So yarn over twice, insert your hook, yarn over, oops, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, and then the last two. Okay, yarn over, turn your work slightly so that you can get to those two stitches there, insert your hook. Yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two, and again, yarn over, pull through one, yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, pull through two. Okay, and we'll double crochet into that next stitch. And we have four more stitches. So in these three stitches here, we're going to do our treble crochet into that third one. Insert your hook. Yarn over, pull through one, pull through two, pull through two, and then two. Twist your work slightly so you can see those two skip stitches. Yarn over for one double crochet. Yarn over for that last double crochet. Okay. Now we have our last stitch here, and we're going to do one double crochet into that last stitch. Just like that. Okay. There's our first row for our Broadway. Nice little example to get you started on some cables maybe. Okay, moving on to our third row. Our third row is going to be all single crochet. So you're just going to chain one and you're going to do one single crochet in each chain across your project. Okay.
doing this single crochet back the other direction helps maintain your project your with your uh, cable on the one side okay moving on to row four we're going to chain three well, this chain start counts as your first double crochet so we'll be working into these skipping this one here we will be working into these three stitches right there okay so start with our treble crochet skipping these two stitches into that third stitch insert your hook and do one treble crochet okay. now we're going to be doing one double crochet into these two skip stitches that we just skipped so we're going to yarn over insert your hook into that the furthest one from the from your treble crochet then another double crochet into that next stitch see how it maintains the treble across on one side okay now into the next chain stitch we're going to do one double crochet and these three chains here these three stitches here is where we're going to be working our next Broadway. So we'll skip these two stitches and in that third stitch, one treble crochet. And then turn your work slightly so that you can get to these two stitches and then you will do one double crochet back into these two stitches. One double crochet and there's your second double crochet into that next chain okay now we will do one double crochet into the next stitch and again in these three stitches we'll be working in so skip two in that third one one treble crochet yarn over for one one double crochet into the stitch and yarn over for your second double crochet into the next stitch okay yarn over for one double crochet in the next stitch into these next three stitches skip two and do one treble crochet into that third skip and that third stitch okay so yarn over turn your work slightly so you can get to these two skip stitches and do one do one double crochet in each stitch each skipped stitch so there's one double crochet second double crochet okay. and now in our last stitch here we will do one double crochet now to continue on into row five you'll do one single crochet in each stitch all the way across and then you will turn your work and then you will begin your Broadway so you want to maintain that treble stitch on one side. Okay. So this is how the front of your work will look with the treble on this treble going across your two doubles, and here's what the back of your work will look like. Okay. Now to end your project, make sure you pull up a loop here. Cut your work. And just take your yarn and pull it through that loop. Pull it nice and snugly, and then you'll take your yarn needle and you'll weave in your ends. Okay? Now that is it for today's stitch lesson. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did and you want to become a part of the Crochet Lefty family, just hit that little red subscribe button there down at the bottom. And you guys have a great day. Bye.